In this video, I'm going to show you how you can count the number of emails that were sent from Excel. Um, I was working with a client this week and he was doing something similar. And this is an old uh, file that I was using for many years earlier for a previous video. But so I have uh, my, ex my email address, the subject and an attachment. And so he was using something very similar and uh, they were sending out a multitude number of, of you know multitude of, of these each day and they needed to report to their boss uh, how many were sent out every day and so what i did is i modified the code so that you would always have an accurate count of how many went out and so what i will do is i will run this code for you and so i'm going to go to macros i'm going to go uh, send email from excel and i'm going to go run Okay, so now I can bring this back. So we had our total, so it says total sent on this date, and it said the total, total email sent on 6-5-2021 was three, which is exactly right. Now, um, let me show you how I did this with the code. I'll just close this down for a sec. Okay, so let me bring up the, the, the code. Okay, so basically, um, this is my standard issue sending emails from Excel, and um, everything's the same. Now, the things that I've added to this is I've added a count. And count, I start with R equals 2 being that, uh, being that, that, that uh, my emails start on the second row here. Um, the count equals 0. Um, when I include this code in the description of my video, I'm not able to add the not equal to sign. And so we'll say the words in the code in my description, not equal to, but you'll, you can replace it with the, this symbol for it to work. Now, um, we go through the whole section and it says, please see your attachment and, um, and the attachments are added and everything's going just fine. Now, um, what we have to do is we have to clear out the fields. Um, set outlook equals nothing and set uh, e outlook mail equals nothing we did this because um if you don't do this and you just send it out as a, a another email then they get the the last attachment that was sent so what i've done here is i've um started again i've at the bottom i say set outlook app create object outlook and so outlook mail outlook uh, app creation now I've changed my subject in this equals subject equals total sent and the date and um, the date just puts in whatever day it is today and I'm sending it to me and and then the body is saying the total email sent uh, on and it's putting the date in automatically and was and then we we're putting we're using the count that we've created for each time we loop through here we count increasing it by one so this is how you count the number of emails that were sent from an Excel list. Please subscribe.